Hey guys, Aunt Gaming here again, bringing you another Rift video. This is the final fight of the River of Souls Chronicle Chains of Death. Uh, right here I'm just messing around looking at Elspeth. Uh, she's talking, talking. This was my first attempt at the dungeon, so I didn't know exactly what to expect, so I knew I had another fight to go. Just kind of looking around. Uh, there was a mini quest you can do, or I guess side quest, that lets you uh, make pets, kind of, I guess, out of unbound creatures. So I have this spirit that I've befriended. It's a giant. So here she's summoning Garoth, who looks like Harold. So she summons him. And this will be the boss. Weird thing is, you can target him, so I'm going ahead and building up my combo points and getting my shield going, because I don't know when he's going to start fighting. So, and my pet's also going nuts on him, as you can tell. So, here we go. In this boss fight, it's a little bit like the GSB uh, Green Scale Blight fighting Green Scale fight. You'll fight him after a little while, he'll lift up in the air. While he's in the air, you could range him, but you're going to be busy running around with ground effects. So, just tank and spank him. I found it really easy, actually. So beat him down, he takes off to the air, and I don't really have any range skills in this spec, so I just run around avoiding these little ground AOEs. And as they get sooner to blow up, they seem to brighten up more. So you run around, he does this for just a couple seconds, then he'll come back down to the ground right to the middle. Here he comes. And then just burn him down the rest of the way. And that's all there really is to the fight. So thanks for watching. Be sure to check out and subscribe to my channel to see more Rift videos. I do stream every Tuesday and Thursday, whatever raids that my progression raid group is doing those days. We mostly do 10-man stuff, so Rise of the Phoenix is usually our Thursday raid, and Tuesdays would be uh, Guild of Prophecy and Ground Halls. We're working on Hammer now with our 20-man group as well. So thanks for watching, and goodbye.